From a cat with two faces to one with eight legs, from the smallest cat breed to the biggest, and the one with demonic facial features. Here is a list of cats that are born only once in a thousand years. Two-Faced Cat Meet the first of its kind, the double-headed Himalayan cat, called the Janus Cat, after the Roman god with two faces. This could be your real-life Zack and Wheezy from the Dragon Tales. The owner adopted this cat when it was a day older and named her Frank and Louie, owing to the fact that it is a dual-faced cat. Although the cat is born with two faces, it uses only one of them to munch on food. Sadly, the Janus cat passed away at the age of 15 despite the fact that survival is not trouble-free with this kind of disability. This Janus cat left a history behind by making it to the Guinness Book of World Records. Well done, Frank and Louie. You did what most can't. Evil-looking cat. Cats are known for their awestruck cuteness, but surprisingly, this evil-looking cat seems to be having her own Halloween party out there. Just take a close look at her. She imitates a ghost under white sheet. This cat does look horrible, but let's be honest, she deserves some kindness, right? On that account, a lady named Jenna Millward took this chinchilla cat home to the UK. While this Wilfred warrior looks unusual with wicked eyes and demon teeth to some people, for Jenna, he is perfect. His peculiar features look discomforting, but as advised by vets, he doesn't need to go through any surgical process. If you just ignore the eye contact for a second, look at how playful he looks here. Um, well, good for this boy. Jenna doesn't mind any bizarre eye contacts. The Lucky Charm You are my lucky charm. I cannot lose you. Imagine swearing this to your cat. Thailand originated Kurat cats are considered a symbol of luck, prosperity, and fertility. They are called Sai Sawat, where Sai is for color and Sawat is for money, which together means the color of money. The blue-gray coats, complemented with big emerald green eyes, are one of the oldest cat breeds mostly found in Thailand only. Kurat cats carry a strong sentimental attachment to their owners. They can't tolerate being alone and get depressed easily. But who would want to leave their good luck charm alone anyway? Back in the day, they were usually gifted to brides as a sign of good fortune. Corat cats were not used to be sold until the mid 20th century. Fattest Cat If you are a cat lover, you know the obsession behind chunky, fluffy, and thick cats but never knew it would lead to this extent. Are you too obsessed with fat cats? Then check this out. Here's Sprinkles, a 32 pound fat cat. That's just thrice more than the average weight of a cat. She's known to be the biggest cat in terms of weight. We all know cats love to eat. Their whole life lies around eating and sleeping. Sprinkles was living the same dream life when she was rescued from a foreclosed house and feeding herself with as much food as she would love to have. Turns out she got herself overweight and was introduced to heart problems. In addition to this, obesity had caused her to have urine burns and poor grooming. Lycoe From furry cats to no fur at all, this strange breed is Lycoe, with fur on some parts of its body. Lycoe comes from the Greek word lykos, meaning wolf. This explains why it is called werewolf, of course a smaller and harmless one. Apart from this, Lycoes are pretty friendly and easygoing cats. They are the result of mutation in domestic shorthair cats in 2011. Birthdays for Lycoes are mostly depressing, since growing up they tend to lose their hair until they are fully gone. Wait a minute, it looks more like a monkey than a werewolf to me, but that's not the point. The good news is you can now own a cuter version of a wolf, or perhaps a monkey, whichever you are more fond of. The Not Photoshopped Cat You probably heard the phrase that beauty comes in all shapes and sizes. In that case, cats come in all colors. Presenting you the most evolutionary rare beauty out there, Venus, the Photoshopped Cat. Her half-black, half-orange face each with distinct eye color, 
is so symmetrically stitched that it just looks too incredible to even believe, hence getting more and more attention all over the internet. Such a munchkin, isn't she? Vets are unable to find the cause behind this gorgeous creation. Maybe it's sugar, spice, and everything nice. Peter Bald. For all I know, a cat's coat is the source of its cuteness. Imagine if it is coatless. Duh! A naked cat! Peter Bald is a species of bald cat mostly found in Russia. They are also called nude cat. Peter Balds are a crossbreed between hairless Donskoy and Oriental short hair. Not every Peter Bald is bald. Some do get a thin layer of coat, which buffs off as they grow. And since they are bald, their skin is temperature sensitive. Therefore, a sunblock should be a must-have in Peter Bald's skincare routine. They do look like the flesh of skin, but happen to be so playful and friendly. Peter Balds are one of the most expensive cat breeds in the world, as with larger ears and a skinny body, people find them pretty graceful. What do you think of it? Flat-headed cat. Fastest swimming cat. Bathing a cat is a mess. Most domestic cats are hydrophobic until it's the flat-headed cats. With spiky teeth structure and flat heads, topped with two tiny ears, they are the fastest swimmers in deep waters. This is just changing my perception of the fact that cats hate water. You'd be shocked to know that there are only two flat-headed cats in captivity in the world. The rest of them can be found in Thailand, Sumatra, Malaysia, and Borneo. They are not found in natural environments, but in accordance with the reports, their traces have been spotted near lakes, riverine forests, and swampy areas in Asia. There's not much information available on this species that logically stated them with the title of being the world's least known cat species. Fishing Cat We all know that cats love fish, but they hate water. Let me introduce a fishing cat, making the impossible possible. Their love of fish is a little too much that they won't mind getting their paws wet. Fishing cats have features that help them swim and hunt their prey underwater. They have small legs, round heads, and a flattened nose. Not just that, they have a thick layer of camouflaged fur with dots and stripes to keep them warm when the water gets chilly. <laughs> Whoa! Did you just see how smoothly she served herself a ready-made fresh dinner? Here's a fun fact. These fishing cats do look cute and adorable, but unlike your domestic cats, they are aggressive and might hop on you to attack. So if you ever encounter these fishing cats somewhere, you should know how to run! Ligers, the largest cat. If you are a fan of both lions and tigers, then let your mind get blown by this rare breed. A liger cat is a cross between a male lion and a female tiger. Although ligers are extremely social animals, they are usually kept in captivity as both parents belong to different species, hence don't share the same habitats. Researchers claim that ligers tend to share more lion traits, even their roar is more like the lion's. It even looks like a lion, doesn't it? But on the contrary, they are very good swimmers, just like tigers. They called the biggest cat for a reason. I mean, it obviously looks big, it can grow for up to 12 feet and 900 pounds, with claws and heads twice bigger than both of its parent species. Due to this, giving birth to a liger cat can be risky for the mother. It can even kill her. Therefore, some people are against their existence, while others crave their presence. Tell us which side you are on by commenting below. La Perm Cat People adore a cat's silky straight coat. Ever imagine a cat with a curly coat? Meet the cat version of the fluffy poodle dog, the La Perm Cat. They sure do look like a hairy cat, not been groomed for years. This cat breed is distinguished by its soft curly coat, which is an outcome of Rex gene mutation. It is yet another accidental cat breed. The first La Perm Cat was born coatless in 1982 on a cherry farm in Oregon. Later, she developed a curly coat, becoming the first curly-haired cat in the world. In 1992, a lady named Linda brought her kittens to a cat show in Portland from where they got recognition as La Perms. And in 2003, 
La Perm got international identification as a separate cat breed. The most attractive cat. As cute as their name is, the Burmilla cats are known to own this from European Burmese and a Chinchilla Persian cat. Interestingly, the Burmilla cats are known to be the most attractive cat breed with green eyes and soft colored coats. Just let the doors open and boom, you got a whole new cat breed. Confused? Well, let me tell you that this magic happened in 1981 when a lilac Burmese cat escaped home and met a male chinchilla cat. Yes, just like that. Which is why despite Burmillas getting common, it is still considered an accidental breed in Britain and not accepted by the registries in the United States. Apart from this, they are getting more popular with each passing day. They are very social cats and love to be pampered. Can you resist accepting the existence of these adorable creatures? Man, they look so loving and playful. Chartrex. Behind these mesmerizing eyes, a lot of mischievousness is hidden. This beauty is a French-originated cat named Chartrax, yet another ancient cat species from the 1550s. Chartrax has an interesting history. They are known to be brought to France with knights upon their return from Persia. The first Chartrax stayed at French monasteries as staples with French monks. Legends say that these monks blow their vows of silence to them. Well, believe it or not, they are indeed very quiet cats. Legends also say that Chartrax became companions to Carthusian monks in French monasteries as they saved their grains from mice. They have beautiful pumpkin golden eyes. They kind of look like British short hair in muscularity, except that they have a petite face. A cat as smart as Chartrax can open doors for itself, play with buttons, or have some tap water if they feel thirsty. They are known to be excellent mouse catchers. If you are looking to get rid of mice in your house, get one. Caracals. A fox with a heavy body or a cat with a foxy face. It is a caracal, another Egyptian cat from Africa and Southwest Asia. Caracals are also called carrot cats, obviously due to their reddish golden colored coat. The name caracal originated from the Turkish word karakulak, which means black ear. Caracals are wild and not suited to keep as pets, except for some countries which allow them. Caracals are also called desert lynx, as both the species bear resemblance in their fancy furry ear design. The gifted ability to silently stalk and tuft ears make caracals the supreme hunters. Their bulky bodies do not stop them from making a three meter long leap. Because, of course, food above all. Man! See how neatly it grabs that bird in? Egyptian Moo. The ancient and fastest. Look at that ancient mews clocking around at 30 miles per hour. The mere resemblance of their body structure with cheetahs helps them run faster. The Egyptian mews are the heirs of wild African cats, which make them creatures from the past. Those gooseberry green mascara eyes and a phenomenal dotted coat possess an admirable beauty. In ancient Egypt, the word mu means cat, hence the name Egyptian mu. While korats are lucky charms for Thai people, Egyptian mus was worshipped by Egyptians as noticed by their old paintings. In World War II, the breed practically came to an end, but luckily, a princess from Rome came to their rescue. She was gifted with a silver kitten, which she kept on breeding, hence saving this cat breed. Norwegian Forest Cat You are a cat lover, but you also want a guard dog. Problem solved! These big, fluffy Norwegian forest cats are here to night watch your gates. Just ignore their middle name because they are likely to be very social and friendly. This warrior cat breed is regarded as the national cat of Norway by King Olaf V. There are a couple of stories attached to this historical breed. Some say they are the offspring of black and white British short hair escorted from Britain to Norway by Vikings and long-haired by Crusaders, while others claim that they are brought to Northern Europe by Romans. To sustain chilly winds, the breed had to modify themselves with blissful thick coats. Isn't it just the most lavish coat among all the cat species? 
Jeffrey's cat. You have seen the biggest cat. Now it's time to get acquainted with the smallest one. Most people get stuck with their cuteness, but what is apparent may not be the truth. These cute creatures are actually wild in nature. Jeffrey's cat, also called the salt cat, is a small wild cat, and because of their liking for water, they are often confused with fishing cats. They are not temperature dependent and enjoy the silence, which explains their satisfaction with South America. The obsession with their baby cheetah looks tends people to breed safari cats or even keep them as pets. Definitely not a pet kind of species to me at least. Carillion Bobtail Sandy toes and sun-kissed skin. Have you ever seen an island cat? A natural cat breed that hails all the way from Russia to Kuril Island are these Kurilian bobtails. These fluffy creatures with pom-pom tails are amazing pets and powerful hunters. Being an island species, they are blessed to have some wow hunting skills, from grabbing a fish from underwater to climbing up a tree for a hamster and hopping in the air to catch a bird. Their overloaded cuteness has made them completely domesticated. They don't mind noisiness and are fun to play with, especially around children. The cherry on top, if you are a fan of the Tom and Jerry show, because you can just watch one live with their superb mousing skills. Andean Mountain Cat. After the islands, it's time to hike in the mountains because turns out these little paws are not so small when it comes to climbing up the mountains. The Andean mountain cats like to stay high in the mountains. Owing to the tough weather conditions, these cats have thick fur, thick enough to imitate a big cat regardless of their small size similar to domestic cats. Why does a cute cat have to be wild? The Andean mountain cats are coated in an ash gray coat painted with stripes and spots with bushy tails that look irresistibly dazzling. Look how steadily it's walking around on a mountain. It will bring you blues to know that this breed might come to an end before you even got the chance to land eyes on it. That is because of climactic change, their natural habitat is in danger. Now the question arises, what can we do to save them? Havana Brown. The next is this rich brown colored cat called Havana Brown. If you are a chocolate lover, you sure will be drooling over their yummy coat color. They are covered in a silky short-haired coat with a chiseled face and big green eyes. They are formerly from Sam, Thailand, and later brought to England and the US. But the mystery behind their name is kind of uncertain. According to some people, they either got the name from Havana Rabbit or could simply be an inspiration from Havana Cigars. Their brown colored whiskers are one of their distinguishing features. Be sure to check that out if you're going to buy one for yourself. Now, if you wonder what kind of personality they'd have, then you won't be surprised to know that these people-oriented cats sure are good companions. Some abnormalities can leave you amazed. Here's an eight-legged AKA, an octet cat, that's going to keep you wondering about its originality. After the picture got rolling on the internet, some sources said that this octet kitty belongs to parents with leg abnormalities. Don't look up so close. It's definitely not photoshopped. Turkish Van. Well, we all know how pretty things are hard to find, such as this beautiful rare cat breed. Turkish Van is one of the natural breeds. They are soft, intelligent, muscular, independent, and above all, they are stunning looking that you will want to cuddle them straight away, but don't let yourselves be fooled by their cuteness because they sure are not your regular lap cats. Just like fishing cats, surprisingly, Turkish vans have a thing for water, hence they love to swim. Here's an amazing fact. If a Turkish van is born with a mark on the shoulder, it is considered to be stamped with good fortune. Even though Turkish van has been knocking around on earth since 1982, they are still known to be one of the rarest breeds. Because surprisingly, only 100 of these cats are being brought to life each year in America. Picky, beautiful, and smart. This beauty is born to sit like a queen. Are you looking to adopt one? I'm sorry if you end up with disappointment. Well, that's all guys for today. Thank you for watching the video. And if you guys found it interesting, I would appreciate it if you comment down below about the video and leave the thumbs up. 
Last but not least, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for getting updates related to our latest videos.